Moving from high school athletics to the college level is no easy task. Now, with the pandemic, their day-to-day -day grind is that much harder. It really has not been um, easy, I would say. Um, we weren't able to practice for three months. Three months many student athletes will never get back. Recent J.H. Rose graduate and gymnast Bailey Bunn is facing this challenge head on as she prepares to compete at the University of Kentucky. We got on Zoom calls and conditioned on there every morning. Um, and I just ran outside and tried to like stay busy. Um, but there's nothing like doing gymnastics. So when we came back, it was a lot. And we had to get back really quickly because I'm leaving in August. The excitement of the college transition is still there, but these athletes are also facing the reality of the pandemic. I'm definitely still excited for school and for football, but I understand that if that has to change because of people's health, then that's something I can get over. Gabe Toriello will join two D.H. Conley High School teammates in suiting up for Barton College's football team this fall. He says setting and working towards goals is keeping him on his path to success. It's been challenging at times. There have been times where I thought, you know, there wouldn't be football, but I've, I've just been waking up and first thing in my mind is, okay, what am I going to do today to help me move forward in that direction of achieving my goal? These athletes are used to working on their mix of sports and academics. The transition during the pandemic is just another thing they're working through. I think that it's hard for girls to keep pushing through this. So when they come back, they're really not where they were. And they're kind of like, oh, I kind of just want to give up. But I kept my eye on the goal the whole time and knew that where I wanted to be, and that's in college and competing for the University of Kentucky. And I kept pushing for, for that goal for three months, and I'm about to leave, so I'm really excited. And their message to other athletes out there, how bad do you want it? I feel like the only person you ever have to beat is yourself. And if you beat yourself, then you'll beat anyone else out there. So always push yourself more than anyone else can push you. Think of a goal and to work hard and to keep that, that goal and that dream safe and protected and to keep chasing after what you want to achieve. Keep striving, that's all I gotta say. The resiliency and determination of these teens shines bright and from one athlete to another, those are the attitudes that will lead you to success. In Pitt County, Kelsey O'Donnell, 90 Your Side.